therabionic device just received FDA approval. We started the work in Europe and examined patients with cancer and identified frequencies that were triggering changes in pulse pressure. In simple word, it means it increases the intensity of the pulse that can be measured manually, that can be confirmed with detectors. Back in the early 2000s, we hypothesized that maybe these tumor-specific frequencies could be used to treat cancer. And we developed a small portable device that delivers radio frequency electromagnetic fields throughout the entire body by means of a spoon, like this one, which is placed on the tongue during treatment. So like you would lick your ice cream, when you connect the spoon to the rest of the body, the entire body becomes an antenna. So that led us to continue our research and we started a novel study in liver cancer back in 2006. Uh, this was done on 42 patients with uh, uh, advanced liver cancer that had no other options. And in the course of the subsequent years, we found that approximately 10% of patients had significant shrinkage of their tumor and 50% of patients had stable disease or um, partial response, which means tumor shrinkage, uh, that lasted more than six months. The FDA um, indicated that the device was approved for commercial use for any patient 18 years or older who has failed first-line and second-line therapy with advanced hepatocellular carcinoma. And patients will take the device home and will be treated three times one hour per day. And for patients who have failed first-line and second-line therapy, they frequently don't have any other alternative but hospice care. So this novel treatment will be an alternative that is apparently devoid of any major side effects, and at least we haven't seen any thus far.